In this video, I'm going to show how we can set up um, a simple pooling reaction on the Firefly. Uh, so here on the deck, we have uh, three plates. Uh, the one on the far right is uh, a source plate. So that's just got green colored liquid in to represent source libraries. Um, then we've got a working plate, which is the blue plate. And then we've got a uh, the colorless plate behind it, which is gonna be where the pool eventually will be placed. Uh, the first thing we're doing is uh, picking up a set of 96 tips. So this is going to be used to aspirate from the source uh, plate of libraries and transfer an aliquot across to the working plate, which is the blue plate. So in this case, it's taken across 20 microliters. It could be a lot less. Um, you know, you could even have um, just a few microliters being transferred across. Um, and by doing this, it means that we actually preserve the original libraries um, and generate a working copy in the blue plate that we can then work across with a single column of tips. So now the, the head is changing um, to pick up a single column of tips. So it's just about to do that. And then what it's going to do is it's going to go across, work across um, that blue plate, aspirating five microliters um, across every position, every column. Um, so that it will ultimately have 60 microliters in the tips and then it's going to move um, across and uh, dispense those into the colorless plate behind so that you've got all um, all of the samples in just a single column. Um, obviously then the user could come, up, come along with a manual pipette and just aspirate across those eight columns and pipette that into a tube. Um, better still actually would be to use a, a single weld column um, bit of labware so you can get uh, plates which for each column there's just a single uh, long well um, that can be accessed by all eight tips um, I don't didn't happen to have one of those bits of labware for running this this demo um, but if you did then the final dispense would be into a single well and then you could simply come along with a pipette and aspirate um, an aliquot or all of that that well and transfer it to a tube for the pool. Uh, and the nice thing about this approach is that um, it means that you have a, the non-contaminated original libraries. Um, you have got a working plate, which required just a single set of 96 tips. And then we can create the pool just using one extra set of uh, strip tips. So it's efficient on tips. It's also very fast because we can just work straight across the, uh, the, the single, um, we can work right across the blue plate, just aspirating all the way. And we're not worried about cross contaminating it because that's just a, a working plate that can go to trash afterwards. So there we have the uh, the final dispense into each of the uh, the wells in the, the last column. And then finally unloading the tips um, and the application is complete. So uh, this is just one of um, a number of demonstration videos that we've got. But if you'd like to know more, uh, please don't hesitate to contact us at uh, SPT Labtech. Um, thank you for watching.